Well, good morning, everybody. This is David George Brook, that gratitude guy with the daily gratitude news for Monday, July 20th, 2020. And the news today, as it is in most days, is more of the many things that gratitude can do for you, especially a gratitude mindset, having that attitude of gratitude. So let's look at it excuse me, today and see what are some of the new things or some of the reminders that we can of what gratitude can do for you. Gratitude makes you more likely to exercise. Boy, that's a good thing. In one 11-week study of 96 Americans, those who were instructed to keep a weekly gratitude journal exercised 40 minutes more per week than the control group. No other study has yet to replicate those results. It could be because other gratitude studies testing this effect have been much shorter in the range of one to three weeks, or it could be because the result was a fluke, but I think that makes a lot of sense. Once again, time will tell. It would be not a surprise to me if gratitude and being grateful for one's health would increase one's tendency to want to protect it by exercising more. How gratitude affects emotions. Gratitude is an emotion, so it probably is not a stretch to consider it could positively affect other emotions. In this section of the benefits of gratitude, we shall look at how gratitude increases resilience and good feelings, positively colors memories, and reduces envy and helps us relax. Gratitude helps us bounce back. We all get down at times, depression, anxiety, loneliness. It happens to us all. Gratitude is not going to make you magically immune to these negative feelings. However, they are a part of life's experience. However, people who express gratitude are more resilient meaning they bounce back faster. These negative emotion swing, emotional swings simply do not last as long. Those that have more gratitude have a more proactive coping style and are more likely to have and seek out social support in times of need and are less likely to develop PTSD and are more likely to grow in times of stress. And lastly for today, gratitude makes us feel good. Surprise, surprise, gratitude actually makes us feel good. Yet only 20% of Americans rate gratitude as a positive and constructive emotion compared to 50% of Europeans. According to gratitude researcher Robert Emmons, gratitude is just happiness that we recognize after the fact to have been caused by the kindness of others. Gratitude doesn't just make us happier, it is, happier, it is happiness in and of itself. Yes, that is what gratitude will do. So that's the message for the gratitude news for today. We'll see you tomorrow with another edition. Remember, be grateful and never quit.